Here we go again, guys. As you can see, I'm in the yard. Um, it's not looking the best because it's been raining. We've got a truck in here. So what am I gonna do now is I'm gonna send the drone up, park in between the trailers, and I'm gonna show you a couple of tips that I have to teach myself. Oh, obviously, Haitian had to teach me a couple of them as well. Basically, what am I gonna do now is send the drone up. I'm gonna have a few cameras laying about, and then I'm gonna take you through how I personally do it myself. Probably like make a few mistakes. I need to like do the shunt forward. I need to go backwards again and then forward again. But that this is how you are, how I do personally manage to get in between trailers without causing any damage. It's one of the most difficult things to do. Driving one of these and you're getting in between trailers. So let's go and see where we're getting in. This is what Haitian in yard looks like, and we're getting in between them two trailers. So as you can see, it's enough space for the truck to get through. If you haven't got any experience whatsoever, it would be really difficult for you to get there. So what am I gonna do is I'm gonna get the truck, I'm gonna get in, I'm gonna swing around, I'm gonna position myself, I'm gonna get about, I'm gonna, I'm gonna swing the trailer, get as close as I can to that without hitting any of the trailers, just giving myself enough space. So I'm gonna give myself enough space a little bit away from the trailer so I can get in and swing out. So the back of my trailer is nearly in position, but I'm gonna leave myself on the trailer a little bit of a gap. So I'm gonna go as far as I can forward, far as I can. So basically what am I gonna do? I'm gonna get to the edge of that building and then the back of my trailer is gonna be pointing this way. So let's send the drone up. Let's say lay a few cameras around and let's see how we do it. Not the best place to be at uh, this time in the morning anyway, but let's get through. All right, let's do it. So we're basically going to go around now and we're going to position ourselves. So it's basically what I'm doing now, positioning myself. And then I'm, I am as close as I can to that gap that I'm going to get into, but not too close because when I swing with the trailer, I don't want to be hitting it. It's enough space for me to get in there. So I position myself, going to get as far as I can over there we are like making it too difficult for me. Whoa. And then now I know I'm in line. So look at this. So, so I don't start turning just yet because it's going to be a tight one. So I need to be as far as I can from the back of my trailer. Arm, and then start turning there. Look at how the trailer is straightening itself out by me just doing that. Yeah, look to the other side, I can't see that. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna go a bit, a little bit in, go in, and then I pull a little bit, no, not a, not a bit, a full lock in. So I don't hit the other one next to it. Trying to keep as close as I can to this one. But as you can see on the drone, it's really, really tight. So if I think I'm gonna hit anything, any of the trailers, I just go forward. But as, I, as you can see, I didn't hit anything. It's straying, it's straight out. And then I just straight myself out. Look at my other mirrors or camera, or whatever you got. And then just go straight back, straight back, slowly, slowly, slowly. And then just stop. And that's it. That's about it. That's how easy it is to get it in. Don't laugh at my head, but that's how simple it is to reverse in between trailers and how to take the trailer up. Take it in mind. That's the way I do it. Works for me. Don't know what works for everybody else. But if you do that step by step, you won't go wrong. But the little bits they have learned, you do that step by step, you're gonna be all right. Nice one. Give it if you like the video, give us a like, give us a subscribe as well, and follow us in all the platforms Trucking UK One and TikTok, which we're doing amazing, and Instagram as well. We're trying to develop Instagram as well. YouTube is where all, all our content is going to be teaching, fun days out, sleeping in the cab, and all that, cleaning the stuff I use, and all that. If you like the content, please follow us, give us a like and comment. Cheers, guys.